Hey, welcome back. Here's sports at this hour. Well, the Horseheads girls basketball team has big things on their mind this year. Check that. Extremely big. Their entire starting five is back, and that could spell championship. And that's something the Blue Raiders haven't won since 2009. They've been beaten by Binghamton three consecutive years in the Class AA Finals. Having that edge and experience is going to pave the way, hopefully, to another title and maybe more. I definitely think we can go out there and prove ourselves this year. Um, we work hard every day in practice, and I think it will really show in our games to come. We're on the floor. We're getting to the ball. We do whatever. We just want to win, so we'll do whatever it takes. We have a lot of good group of seniors that are coming back, um, you know, that have been around for three years, four years, and I think it's nice to have people that are used to the system, that are accustomed to what we expect here, and I think that's the important part. All right, well, Horsehead's going to host Union Endicott December 11th in their first game of the season. Well, one game, one moment. WNY TV Sports went through the video archives to find the fall sports moment of the season. October 26, we go back to that. Elmira Express football pulling off a stunner versus the Corning Hawks in the Class AA semis. Elmira upset the Hawks 45-25, and plays like this certainly helped. Rashawn Brooks, 97 yards for a pick six touchdown. Also, Jerry McPeak put home a few more touchdowns in this one. Congrats to the Express for our fall moment of the season. Well, the Chemung County Sports Hall of Fame hosts Ernie Davis Day Saturday at the Arnett Mall in Big Flats. Now this is pretty cool here. A replica of Davis's Heisman Trophy will be on display at the hall, which is located by the main entrance from noon until 5 p.m. And that's not all. The finalists will be announced for the Ernie Davis Award, which honors the area's top high school football player. That'll be at one in the afternoon. For more information, visit WNY.com and click on sports. December 29th, Davis's alma mater Syracuse will play in the Pinstripe Bowl for the second time in three years. And this one's going to feel like some old times. The Cues will tackle former Big East foe West Virginia. Syracuse crushed the Mounties 49-23 last season. And for head coach Doug Marone, seeing them again in this one is a great thing. Uh, we're excited. Our, our kids are excited. Uh, you know, both teams know each other. Uh, I think it's going to be an outstanding game. I do believe it'll be... Uh, the best game to, to so far uh, with the pinstripe bowl. 